Hello everyone, it's Squeaker Wood HCG coming to you on Friday at 8.20. Just wanted to come on for just a minute. I got home because I'm so sad to tell you all that Art died last night at um, about 12.30. My friend called me and said that he just passed away and it was so sad because both of her his boys were there and um so weird they went and had beer and my friend stayed with her ex-husband until he died so i felt really bad for her she was i think she went through a lot of emotions and i think it was just really a hard time for her and i wish she had called me earlier and i wish i could have gone and you know you have all those regrets but anyway, and then tomorrow she's going out of town, so I just decided I would come home, and I'm so glad. My husband and I went out to eat. We went out to eat. We went to the Outback, and um, I had some steak and a little lobster. Went over a little bit, but I did good other than that, so I'm not going to really worry about that today. Day. See what my see my necklace. I'm backwards. H A R L E Y. My husband said it thought it said he said, Why are you wearing a necklace that says horny? My necklace doesn't say horny. It says Harley. So I stepped on the scales this morning and had another about a half a pound. I think it's 0 .4, 0 .5. Um, so I'm to 171. I don't remember exactly. I didn't even get it written down yet because 171.67, something like that. I can't remember exactly, but I'm down 32.8 pounds as of today so I'm happy about that I think it's point four then so I'm really happy about that so um, hopefully I'm home and will do much better I mean I feel like like I told you all I feel like I did really good considering five weeks of eating out every day so I come home and eat out <laughs> um, what else was I want to tell you oh yesterday was my year two-year anniversary of my divorce from my ex-husband so I spent the day with my youngest daughter which if you haven't watched on my blogs she is married my daughter is married to my ex-husband so we were having dinner she and I were having dinner with my parents last night and she had a to-go box and she was riding on it and she put 314 and I thought 314 that's the day that's the two-year anniversary of our divorce and then in July they'll be married for two years so anyway it was just um, you know I was sitting there as we were having dinner and I thought I thought you know I, I just don't know I was telling my husband I just don't know how he can wake up each day and open his eyes and look in the mirror and say you know I'm a good person He's got a little girl that's about, she's probably 13, 14 now. And I think, you know, I wonder what he's going to do if anybody ever does this to her. So anyway, just a little reflections and, you know, as I thought about it, my mom and I talked a little bit because it, it bothered me a little bit. But, you know, I told her, I said, but, you know, people think I'm crazy, but this is the way I feel about it is that it's not on me it's not on me it's in God's hands he's the judge and at some point I believe that he's gonna open his eyes and realize that you know he's done some ugly 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 things and um, I believe my daughter will go down that road as well I love her with all of my heart and uh, but I won't uh, you know I'll, I'll have dinner with her and I'll be a good mother to her and um, let her see the light of the Lord that lives within me and um, you know all you can do is be proud of who you are and what you're willing to do you know as far as especially in the face of ugliness and uh, 
when your adversary is right in your eyeballs, you know, you just have to say, I'm going to be bigger than what the situation is. So, anyway, I know that this is beating a dead horse, but yesterday was just, just a day. So, I'll be vlogging again because um, whenever, whenever that happened, I had the 14th of March was my, my, I hate to say anniversary because it's just that, that anniversary sounds like a good thing, but it, it's the two years. And then on the 18th, I lost my job. And then on, on March the 17th last year, I had my motorcycle wreck that should have killed me. So, um, I was telling my husband tonight, there's been so much water that's gone under the bridge. And um, it's just so much that it's hard to even tell you. And uh, I wanted to mention also today, uh, my friend and I had lunch before I left. And um, I had a pack of gum. I opened it. And guess what was inside of it? A dime. There was a dime inside my pack of gum. <laughs> it was crazy. Anyway. Oh, Parker, see my hat? I've turned around. I told you I need to get you a hat. I'll show you the back of it. I love this hat. I don't wear very many hats because I feel like it makes me look all... Anyway, so my husband is in there making the bed and um, he's not feeling very well. He's been sick for a couple of days, so... Um, but he was glad to see me. We've had a good, good evening, so... Anyway, I guess I will go for now, and I will talk to you guys later. I'm so excited to be able to be home to watch you guys and to get caught up with everybody and, and watch the new people and all that sort of stuff. So, anyway, I will talk to you guys later. Love you. Bye.